Hi everybody, um, please uh, make sure you're watching these uh, update videos all the way through. And you got to remember we don't have a classroom, so um, it's so important for your success that we just keep in contact and, and you really understand what's required in the class. And please make sure to read all my emails as well. Okay, so a few things I want to go over is that I've... Um, <clears throat> improve the instructions for turning in your written work so um, if you go to modules and how to turn in your written work I've made it a lot clearer now um, and I've made a new video as well if you want to watch that so if you're still confused on this please go here watch the video go through the things so you don't email me anything you wait until the chat you've taken the chapter six test and then turn everything in for chapter six all at once video notes textbook homework and the reviews the review work that you do uh, put it all on one file it can be a PDF or it could be something else combine pdf.com is easy to use and um, then you go to the assignment uh, that comes after the chapter six test so I'll show you where that is so after the chapter six test you'll see this little assignment here it says written work for chapter six click on that and that's where you turn in all of your work okay so um, let's see next thing is that um, I have adjusted the schedule for you guys so now 6.1 is due by Monday and you can see the schedule by going to calendar um, and if you're already on it that's great and I really would encourage you guys to go ahead of schedule so you know keep working ahead you're allowed to go as far ahead of schedule as you want and in this course we really do have a lot of work okay so one of the things I'm thinking of, I, I've talked about and we're going to go ahead with it is I'm just going to make the textbook homework optional for this course apart from what's already on the quizzes so in other words you can skip some of the textbook homework if you need to to save time to stay on schedule I know you guys were expecting an on-campus class online math can be um, is not your desired uh, mode and so and, and also a lot of you are busy with the shutdown and that's fine so what I'm suggesting is if say you're on 6.2 or any particular section you just click on the video you write down the examples on paper, click on the next video, write down the examples on paper and do all the videos and then you just go down here, click on the quiz and take the quiz and whatever homework questions you're asked to do in the quiz just do those and don't do any other textbook homework. So here you'll do question 4, 6, 8, 18, 20 and so on all the way down to you know 84 and then you're done right and then submit the quiz. Um, so in other words you'll be skipping mainly odd numbered textbook homework and it'll save you a little bit of time. So once again, just required to do the video examples and the quizzes and the reviews. Once again, make sure to get the reviews done before you take the test. Try to get full points on these reviews because the questions I put on here are going to be just like what's on the test. So when you're doing your review, absolutely do all of the textbook homework to make sure that you're ready for that chapter six test and that you get a good score. All right. OK, so let's see other things to talk about um, if you're still want to figure out how to use that online textbook I actually made a new video for that to try to explain it uh, even clearer um, and so go to no textbook yet click on the video watch the video it'll show you how to use the online textbook everything's online for free it'll show you how to get the answers and uh, find where the questions are and all that if um, you need financial assistance to help you get through the term, um, definitely go here and submit an application. Of course, there's restrictions, but this is uh, free money, not a loan. The college has lots of funding for students that need help, uh, genuinely need help to help you get through the quarter. So please consider doing that. Today is the last day to drop class and get a full refund. You can send an email here or you can uh, just uh, go to the Welcome Center on Zoom. Um, and I think that's all I've got for now. And please send me an email or give me a call anytime if you have any questions or you need help with anything.